hello everyone welcome back to my channel so guys i'm going to show you how i make a coffee rinse so the first thing guys i do is i make this coffee rinse now if you have a coffee maker that's great i don't drink coffee so i don't have one so what i do is i take a pot i boil the coffee in it with water and i actually buy the coffee strain and use those and strain it to make sure i don't have any bits and pieces left because i can't get that in my hair guys and i just boil it for about five minutes and mix it in there and go ahead and strain it so I can just have the rinse now coffee rinse guys a few benefits about it is when it's used topically on your hair it does a great job when it goes to the roots it stimulates hair growth it improves the structure and growth of your hair it can help to restore hair growth and prevent hair loss it also may help to speed up the hair growth cycle it also may help to increase length retention guys because it's going to make your hair softer so less breakage less tangles it also adds a lot of luster to your hair and make it a force more manageable because it's going to be softer and it's going to help to exfoliate your scalp and improve the color of your hair if you have darker color hair now guys if you have blonde hair or any lighter color hair definitely take into account that the coffee can dye your hair and make it darker i see you'll notice that your hair is darker if you have more lighter hair like blonde hair now one of the great things about this coffee rinse is you guys know i'm working on improving my hair growth but also working on those bald spots that i got over the years of not taking care of my hair it helps to block the dh T hormones that is responsible for hair loss after I make this coffee rinse I allow it to cool down and I leave it there while I go in I shampoo my hair as usual I hot oil it before and then shampoo it after I shampoo I rinse it out guys then I go and deep condition my hair After I deep condition my hair, I will go and rinse that out of course and then we'll pour the coffee all over it. Now I make sure I soak my hair all the way. I even take a little cup and soak the ends and let them sit in there for about 10 seconds and soak it in and make sure it's completely covered in coffee and I go in and I make sure my hair is doing great. Every area is covered guys. And I will cover my hair with a plastic cap and allow it to sit for 20 minutes guys. Now you want this to sit in your hair because this is a great way to use your body's indirect heat to help to open up your hair follicles hair shaft and help that soak in and let it sit on your hair and really go in those strands and do that work to soften your hair because once you take that cap off guys you're going to feel how soft your hair feels it already feels great it already looks great you can see your curls your hair will look amazing already before you even rinse it out i didn't even want to rinse it out guys when i saw my hair looking like this but i do go after final rinse and do a cold rinse and just rinse that out very briefly i don't stay under the water for too long just make sure it's rinsed out I love this rinse guys. I've been doing it for about a month now and I love the result. I love how my hair feels. It's much softer. I have way less breakage and shedding from when I'm combing out my hair now. I'm retaining more length and I love the result and I'm going to continue using it with my T rinse. If you're looking to retain length guys, get healthier looking hair and it help improve the color of your hair if you do have darker brown to black hair. This is a great rinse to use for that. So doing a coffee rinse is not just a rinse to soften your hair guys. It's a great way to get healthy strong hair improve the growth and also stop unnecessary shedding and breaking which is always great when you want to grow out your hair so thank you guys so much for watching if you haven't already guys of course subscribe to my channel and click the little notification bell so you'll know when i have new videos out give this video a thumbs up and leave all of your comments down below if you do any other rinse or how you do your coffee rinse if you do them leave all of those comments down below and go over and watch my last video